Well, the numbers are big. More than 1.1 million military spouses live in the United States, and many of those are stationed with their husbands or their wives right in our backyard at Fort Hood. In its 13th year honoring the dedication of the millions of military spouses in the nation, Armed Forces Insurance recognizes a spouse from all six branches who has sacrificed and given endless support to their community. Six News reporter Nicole Sheeran spoke with one Central Texas woman who exemplifies those characteristics and joins us now in studio to tell us more about her impact. Nicole? Guys, after more than 30,000 national votes, Julie Mosher has been named the 2023 Armed Forces Insurance Fort Hood Spouse of the Year. And well, it's no secret why. In 2013, Julie's life changed forever after she was diagnosed with breast cancer. Endless treatment and trips to the hospital became difficult for her family to financially manage. Her husband, Robert Mosher, returned home from deployment and the struggle continued. In 2017, Julie then found founded Pink Warrior Angels as a way to bring hope to people facing tragedy and give support to those fighting a daily cancer battle, a fight that her mother ultimately lost. And while we are volunteers and none of us get paid, it is the most rewarding thing I could ever do. Um, my mom unfortunately has passed from metastatic breast cancer. She was diagnosed five years after me. And I can tell you just a year ago while she was dying, she said, don't stop. And, and I know it's hard work, but you have a giving heart. Julie has a giving heart that only keeps on growing. What started as support just for women with cancer has transformed into help for every individual fighting each day. Now, Julie told me that being named Fort Hood Spouse of the Year is of course an honor, but it's a way to continue a legacy of one of her best friends. Tonight at 10, hear about this fellow Spouse of the Year who ultimately lost her battle to breast cancer with Julie right by her side. Oh boy, it's gonna be a tough one tonight at 10, but we're looking yeah. forward to your story. And it's great to spread that awareness too, Nicole. Absolutely. Thank you so much.